the Animus serial killer. Deathmatch imminent. Hello and welcome to my Assassin's Creed Revelations multiplayer session of Deathmatch. I'm with my vizier and we're in Rome. Your objective is to find and kill assigned targets. Avoid being killed by other Templars. First blood. Yeah, I just thought I'd let that animus lady finish speaking before I started. <laughs> Got my first blood. Awesome. So, anyway, I'm sorry I haven't been uploading for a couple of weeks. I have had quite a lot on. And before any of you start writing in the comments already about my profile set, I will be explaining it. I mean, throwing knives and teleporting deathmatch. Who'd have thunk it? I mean, it's just really the most ridiculous setup to use in this mode. Um, but yeah, I'll explain it in just a moment. Yeah, so uh, quite a lot of you will know that since January 2012, I've been a machinima partner. And in the last week or so, I've just signed contracts with them to also become a machinima director. Which is just fab news. Yay! <laughs> Now that actually just means that I can now start uploading videos to their channel and I'm really excited about that. I mean that that's just oh so fabulous. I mean to get recognized by Machinima anyway is really really hard. It's very hard work to become but the, to, you know to become a director as well. Um, yeah it just it does take a long long time and a lot of work. It really does. But it's all paid off. I'm there. Yay! Contracts are signed and it's all done. The only thing is, is that they wanted me to come up with an idea for a series on Assassin's Creed. And I proposed something that I already do. And they're really up for it. And so I'm just really, really thrilled. Now, you know I do subscriber challenges where I get you to set the challenge for me. You know, you pick... Whatever you like, you can even pick my character, uh, you can pick my abilities, my perks, my streaks, you know, all of that, and I have to win a match with what you tell me to use. And yeah, so they're really up for it, so from now on, any subscriber challenges that I do will be going on to Machinima Respawn. Now, that's just absolutely amazing, I can't wait! You know, that they have like 1.2 million subscribers. <laughs> I mean, wow. And so, yeah, my series is going to be on there. So, yeah, if you want to set me challenges, you know, feel free to do so. But I'm only going to really be taking the challenges now that are going to be put, um, like, via my Machinima videos. But, you know, if you don't subscribe to them, and you should, but if you don't... Um, I am going to be posting the links to any videos that I upload. I'm going to be posting the links to my Facebook and my Twitter. So, wait a minute here, wait a minute, wait a minute. There was two vanguards and now there be one. Where the heck? <laughs> it was an NPC, wasn't it? It must have been and she got slapped out the way. I don't know. <laughs> there are a few crazy things that happen in this match and... Um, <laughs> this was actually supposed to be a subscriber challenge and it was supposed to be my very first like pilot episode for Machinima um, Respawn but I decided not to use it because this has some really crazy bizarre moments mainly I think lag and to be quite honest for my very first episode I would really rather it didn't have things like that in it because I don't normally suffer with issues with Assassin's Creed, I really don't. You know, it really is very rare that anything happens bad. And so, yeah, I really just didn't want this one to go on to respawn. And, uh, yeah. So that's why I've got this ability set, actually. This was a match that I played um, first, actually. Uh, and then the second one after this one, um, that's the one that will be going on Machinima Respawn. But yeah, I'm gonna. Uh, don't forget, you've got to check out my video description for the links to my Facebook and Twitter if you don't want to miss any of the videos that I upload to them. Because uh, yeah, as I said, I'll be posting the links on Facebook and Twitter. And my Facebook's a great page anyway. Everyone's just really lovely, and it's a lovely little community. I say little. 
but you know there's over 1,300 likers on there at the moment so yeah get on there I mean I also run competitions as well I want uh, I run a weekly one and a monthly one and I, I give away prizes so anyway what else has been happening what's new with you lot well don't all speak at once <laughs> Uh, just messing. Oh, I have to say something, by the way. I, I've had this subscriber ask me a question for... A, oh, he's been asking me this for so long now. And I keep promising that I will do this, and I just keep forgetting. So, um, what he wants me to do is say hippopotamonstrosasquitdaliophobia. And <laughs> what that is, is just a fear of long words. Uh, which baffles me. I mean, it's 36 letters long, for goodness sakes. So who, in their right mind, ever made up a word 36 letters long that actually is a medical term for fear of long words? That's just absolutely stupid. You can imagine doctors and psychiatrists and everything sat round a table, can't you, just having a laugh about it? You know, oh, what should we call this phobia? Oh, I know. Let's call it the most ridiculous ever. They'll never get it out. <laughs> it's like, oh, good. what did they call a fear of ghosts? Is that going to be something like, you know, shut up in your face or I'll come and haunt you when you sleep, alophobia? I just... <laughs> Yeah, so there you go. I said it, and that was for no one B, uh, no one BHS. So yeah, I could easily happily say a thirty-six letter long word, but I had to actually ask him how to pronounce his name because <laughs> I didn't know, <laughs> and that's only like seven letters long. Now I don't know if you just saw that, but we have people flying across the screen here. I, I mean, is that really lag? <laughs> I don't know, they must be having rocket fuel for breakfast or something because, wow, people are just zooming everywhere towards like this part, uh, this part and to the end of the match. That's bizarre. Going after little Miss Courtesan again. Now the person that's playing the Courtesan actually, they are going to be in the Machinima video because they were also in like, the, oh god, look at that. So I'm sorry, I just got people flying across the screen and it's like, whoa. Yeah, um, that person was in the match that follows on from this that I'll be uh, giving to Machinima Respawn. Um, so, lost. hello to them. Ground finish. <laughs> hello to them and then go kick them in the head. That's not very nice. Now, I did actually try to um, get a throwing knife going there at um, the Sentinel, but for some reason didn't work I've been playing well as, as I've been saying actually I've been playing loads of Fallout 3 and loads of Fallout New Vegas or replaying them should I say and I play oh gosh you flew across the screen what <laughs> um yeah so I'm kind of having to get used to the controls again you know I've been playing everything else for so long you know it just took me a while to get my bearings back on um Assassin's Creed and guess who just became a big fan of Deus Ex? Oh my god! Me? Um, wow. I've never seen any gameplay of it before, and I wanted to actually download some DLC for Fallout New Vegas, but something went wrong with my Xbox. I can't download at the moment on it. Um, they, they've put kind of a block on my account, actually, because I, I download too many... Oh, I buy too many points can you believe that i buy too many points so they block my account because they think somebody's acting fraudulently no i buy them and i actually spend them and anyway <laughs> so um i went looking for like different games that i might like and so i thought i'd have a look at deus ex and i watched uh, like the the woman who wrote the game oh who the hell does she just slap what uh, the woman who wrote the game, I watched her little walkthrough on how to do, like, um, you know, non-lethal kills and lethal kills and all sorts. And I thought, yeah, I could do that. It looks quite good. So I ordered it, and it arrived a couple of days ago, and I just can't keep off of it. But what is it? You know, why do they always make a few pixels, shove them together, and you just end up with this amazing hunk? Oh, my God. He's delicious. 
Hang on. Note to self. Boyfriend sometimes watches videos of mine. Do not refer to any character, whether fiction or not, as punk. There we go. Note to self. <laughs> anyway, that's the end of the match. Thank you ever so much for watching. It certainly wouldn't be me if I didn't die in the last 10 seconds. But anyway... I'm sorry for my absence, but yes, I'm back and I'm still here. Uh, but don't forget to check out the video description for the links to my Facebook, my Twitter, and my live stream. And uh, I hope to see you in my next match. And if not, I will see you on Machinima Respawn. And by the way, I am still keeping uploading videos on my own channel. That will not change. I'll just be adding some to Machinima Respawn. So there we go. So thanks ever so much for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.